Biosphere is the main recording name of Ger Jensen, born the 30th of May 1962, a Norwegian musician who has released a catalog of electronic music. He is well known for his works on ambient house and arctic themed pieces, his use of music loops and peculiar samples from science fiction and nature sources. His 1997 album Substrata was voted by the users of the Hyperreal website in 2001 as the best all-time classic ambient album. He has also composed several film scores. History Prior to Biosphere (1962–1991), Jensen was born on the 30th of May 1962 in Tromsø, a city within the Arctic Circle in the northernmost portion of Norway. He was inspired by the music of artists such as New Order, Depeche Mode, Wire, and Brian Eno, which he described as like discovering a new universe a universe which I wanted to be a part of". In 1983, he bought his first synthesizer and composed his first piece of music, taking influence from his archaeological studies, later stating, "...studying the Ice Age and Stone Age has definitely influenced my music." In 1984 Jensen issued his first album, Lickvider, released on cassette only and credited to E-Man. In 1985, Jensen was part of the newly created Norwegian moody synth trio Bel Canto with Nils Johansson and singer Anneli Drecker. The band signed with Belgian label Crammed Discs and to Network in North America, and relocated to Brussels. Jensen, however, soon returned to Tromso, collaborating with the other band members by post, and continuing with his solo work. Bel Canto released two albums while Jensen was a member, White Out Conditions and Birds of Passage. In 1990, he left the band in order to pursue a different music style altogether, and began using a sampler. Throughout the late 1980s, Jensen used the moniker Bleep, under which he produced various 12 inches records, now releasing records via the Crammed Discs subsidiary SSR. His early influences were from Acid House and New Beat Music. Released in 1990, The North Pole by Submarine was the only album recorded as Bleep. Further singles followed in 1990 and 1991 before Jensen abandoned the Bleep moniker and again changed musical direction. Topic as Biosphere 1991 present Following the release of The North Pole by Submarine, Jensen began releasing his music as Biosphere on obscure Norwegian compilation albums. His first Biosphere releases were the 12-inch single The Fairy Tale and the album Microgravity, both of which were rejected by SSR as unmarketable. Microgravity was released in 1991 on the Norwegian label Arigo Sound, and saw wider release via the R&S Records subsidiary Apollo in 1992, to much critical acclaim. In 1992, Jensen contributed All Strangle You to Hector Zazu's Sahara Blue Project. In 1994, the second Biosphere album, Potashnik, was released, through which Jensen continued to explore his ambient house stylings to an even greater extent. Potashnik contained the first hints of the reduction in beat driven song structure that would mark later Biosphere releases. Unlike the first album, Potashnik was quickly picked up by a comparatively large international audience, which brought Biosphere greater recognition. Jensen also recorded as Cosmic Explorer, scoring a hit in Belgium with the EP The Hubble. In 1995, Levi Strauss and Co. was searching for a new angle to add to their television advertisement campaign, which up to that point had never featured electronic music, and they decided to use the uptempo track Novelty Waves from Potashnik. 
Shortly thereafter, Novelty Waves was released as a single featuring remixes by various other artists, and managed to chart in several countries, reaching number 51 in the United Kingdom. Although Jensen never regretted his approval for use of the track, he also never sought this kind of fame and subsequently turned down various requests by his record company and peers to collaborate with well-known techno and drum and bass artists or to create a follow-up album in the same style. During that same year, Biosphere contributed the song The Seal and the Hydrophone exclusively to Apollo 2, the Divine compilation released by Apollo Records. Substrata 1997 is a purely atmospheric ambient Biosphere album released on All Saints Records. Substrata, which marked Jensen's embarkation towards an intensely minimal style, is not only often considered to be Jensen's best work to date, but is also seen as one of the all-time classic ambient albums. Substrata contains samples from the American TV show Twin Peaks. In 2000, Jensen released Cirque on his new home Touch, an ambient album driven by muffled beats, samples, and minimal atmospherics. Though Cirque briefly revisited territory covered by earlier Biosphere releases, the rhythm section throughout the album remains an element of the background, unlike Jensen's first two Biosphere releases, wherein the drums occupied a dominating proportion of the foreground. In 2002, he released Shun Zhou, the fifth full-length album under the name Biosphere. This album was a more abstract work, comparable to Affix Twins' 1994 album Selected Ambient Works Vol. 2. The material on the album draws from elongated, pitch-shifted loops taken from Debussy's La Mer the sea, and Ju. Released in 2004, Autour de la Lune stands as the most minimal and austere Biosphere album to date. The drones employed on this album are comparable to Coil's 1998 album Time Machines in their timbre and slow rate of change. The bulk of this work was originally commissioned and broadcast in September 2003 by Radio France Culture for a musical evocation of Jules Verne. In 2006, Jensen released Dropsond, a half-beatless, half-rhythmic album composed of jazz rhythms evocative of Miles Davis's 1970s jazz fusion works. A partial vinyl sampler was released a few months earlier in 2005. In 2009, Biosphere issued Wireless, live at the Arnold Feeney, Bristol, his first live album, containing new tracks such as Numa and Numa 2. Jensen has scored a number of films, including Eternal Stars and Insomnia. 1997. He collaborated with German ambient composer Pete Namluck on Fires of Orc, and has also worked with Ja Wobble's Invaders of the Heart and with Bobby Bird of Higher Intelligence Agency. In 2010, two soundtracks were announced on Biosphere's website, for German film, I am Schatten, and Norwegian, NOKAS. On 27 June 2011, Gare Jensen released the album N Plants, inspired by the Japanese post war economic miracle. The album theme is related to nuclear plants in Japan. In 2016, Jensen released Departed Glories as Biosphere. The thematic focus of the album draws inspiration from the defense of Krakow from Nazi invasion during the Second World War. Jensen conceived of the album while living in the city. Topic: Live Biosphere regularly performs live during electronic music festivals and in clubs throughout Europe and various other locales around the world. Live performances usually consist of Jensen performing improvisations or variations on newer tracks on a laptop while video art is projected behind him, for example, full-screen video art was projected in his Picturehouse Cinema Tour in April 2006. 
Although these performances are rarely tied specifically to a recent album release, the uptempo material from the Bleep and Microgravity, Potashnik era is occasionally featured in Biosphere performances. In May 2004, Biosphere's first United States performance took place in Detroit. In 2008 Jensen announced a year-long break from touring due to his reported hatred of airports, security checks, unhealthy food, air conditioning, hotels, etc." However he resumed concert activity in 2009 and 2011. Other interests Jensen is also an active climber and mountaineer. This hobby is an inspiration on his work, as well as a source of natural sound samples. His highest feat was in 2001, climbing the Cho Oyu Himalaya, 8,201 meters, without oxygen. In 2006, he thus released Cho Oyu 8,201 meters field recordings from Tibet as Gare Jensen. Topic: Discography. Topic: Solo discography. Albums as E-Man. E-Man, 1984. Albums as Bleep. The North Pole by Submarine, 1990. Albums as Biosphere. Microgravity 1991 Potashnik 1994 Substrata 1997 Cirque 2000 Substrata Squared 2 CD reissue of Substrata with man with a movie camera 2001 Touch Shunjo 2002 Touch Autor de la Lune 2004 Touch Dropsond 2006 Touch Wireless Live at the Arnold Feeney Bristol 2009 Touch N Plants 2011 Touch L'incoronazione di Papia 2012 Potashnik 2 Tracks recorded between 1992 and 1994 2014 Das Subarkord EP 2014 Departed Glories 2016 Black Mesa EP 2017 The Petrified Forest 2017 The Hilverenbeek Recordings 2018 Soundtracks and Sounds Eternal Stars 1993 Film Soundtrack Man with a Movie Camera 1996 Festival Soundtrack 2001 Release in Substrata Squared Insomnia 1997 soundtrack for the original Norwegian version of Insomnia Cho Oyu 8201 meters field recordings from Tibet as Ger Jensen 2006 Ash International Nokas 2010 film soundtrack as Ger Jensen Kill by Inches soundtrack to the 1999 movie Kill by Inches released 2012 Stromboli – Field recording from the Stromboli Crater Edge 2013 12 inches single released on Touch Sound Installations 2000–2009 2015 Collaboration discography Usually as «Gare Jensen» instead of «Biosphere» Whiteout Conditions 1987 in Bel Canto Birds of Passage 1989 in Bel Canto Fires of Orc 1993 with Pete Namluk Polar Sequences 1996 live with Higher Intelligence Agency Nordheim Transformed 1998 with Deathprod remixing Arn Nordheim 
Biosystems, The Biosphere Remixes 1999, collection of eight other bands Birmingham Frequencies 2000, live, with Higher Intelligence Agency Fires of Orc 2 2000, with Pete Namluk Stater 2015, with Deathprod Touch Topic. See also List of ambient music artists